We're here at Iron Pigs Media Day with uh, with Lane Adams. He's an outfielder for the Iron Pigs in 2019, and I got a couple questions for him. First, I want to welcome welcome you to the Iron Pigs. You've been here before. A couple times, yes. Thank you very much. And, and you've had some success here. I looked up some some games. You've had some hits here. Do you remember that or not really? Yeah, not that many though. So hopefully that changes. All right. Now you and uh, you and Phil came over from uh, from Gwinnett. You were both there together last year. Yes, sir. We were we were both in Atlanta with the, the Braves last year. All right. So uh, you brought him or he brought you? He signed first, so I guess he brought me. <laughs> uh, the um, your nickname, the L.A. Swiftness, used to steal some bags. Yeah, uh, that's. You're gonna steal some this year? I'm gonna try to. I gotta get on first, but that's the plan. Uh, yeah, I really don't really know how I came up with that. It's just kind of a play on between my initials and LA Fitness, the yeah. gym, and yeah. I don't know. Yeah, it's, it's all right. It's cool. One of my questions I'm asking today, one of the fun ones, I'll skip to that one before I get back to baseball. I was asking about uh, you're in the, and this is probably you when you were with uh, with with Atlanta last year. Uh, Players Weekend, you put your nickname on the back of your jersey. The LA Swift, is that what you put on there? Yeah, that's what, I, that's what I put on there in 2017. That's what I guess I put on there if I'm up there again. So that's, that's all I got. It's all, all right. It's all all right. I, you play uh, all three outfield positions? Yep, all three of them. Do you feel like center field is any easier than the other two or not really? Some people have said that read the ball better in center field. Uh, I think everyone who's kind of played center the majority of their careers would say center's easier because you have more control and you get truer reads. But, yeah, that's definitely the case. But the other two, they're kind of the same to me. All right. You're kind of the basketball guy around here, I heard. Is that right? I was. I got beat in a three-point contest spring training. So. All right. So you're putting, you're putting together a team for the Iron Pigs. So I got, he's got to be on it then, right? Absolutely. Absolutely. No doubt. All right. Who else? Um, I'm gonna say Dylan Cousins. Yeah. Uh, who else? Gosselin had a pretty good jump shot. I like Gosselin's jump shot. And I had to go one more. Uh, oh, Rob Brantley. Not j jump shot was terrible, but he has a lot of energy, and you can just be that guy who just guards the other team's best player and All just right. wear him out. All right. Uh, last question. To another basketball question. You're six foot four. Is that right? Yes. All right. Best. <laughs> NBA player of all time who is six foot four. Oh, that is tough. Six foot four. Is there an answer on this? Speed? Is there an answer? Yeah, I, I think I got an answer for you. See, you could tell me whether you agree or not. What was your answer? Dwayne Wade. Is he six four? Or six? Yeah. Oh, it's his listed that. as. Yeah, yeah, that's a, yeah. I thought he was six five, six six. But yeah, if that's the case, definitely. Because no I, I I looked it up both ways. I looked it up current player and all time. And he came up both ways. Yeah, that's a, that's a, you got my vote on that one, no doubt. <laughs> All righty, thanks a lot. Have a good season. Thank you.